Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So first things first, can we talk about my super cute pink choker? I did it myself, I did it myself, thank you, thank you, I know I'm super talented. But anyways, so today's gonna be a different type of video. I'm not gonna be doing any tutorial, I'm gonna tell you guys all of my favorite products that I'm using at the moment. So I separated kind of like, I'm gonna do like uh, primers and everything first, and then I'm gonna dive into foundation and concealers. Then we're gonna talk about eyeshadow palettes, highlighters, which is everybody's obsession. And then we're gonna finish off with lipsticks. So the first part that I wanna show you guys, this new Hourglass Veil Primer is amazing. I think the formula is super silky. Like you immediately put it on your skin and you start like rubbing it on your face and it just feels like silk. Like I don't even know. Like I put it on and I just wanna like roll it all over my body. I literally wanna feel like, I don't know, like a silk cloth, silk, anything, just anything silk. I just wanna put it all over my body. Um, I think it really like grabs onto the makeup really well. I think it doesn't like shift colors like some primers do if they're not like that really good. And I really personally love it. So, and I think like the, I think the bottle is glass. Like, I don't know. I have no idea. It feels glass. Anyways, then the Tarte Mario Royale. You guys very well know that I cannot live without this thing. Like, I think it's like full because I literally just finished my last one because I literally use it for everything in my life. Like, I want to like bathe. I want to bathe in everything, like I just thought of it. I literally want to bathe in everything all the time. So I literally use this product for everything. I use it for my lips, conditioning my lips, I use it for my face, I use it like as a night treatment. I use it for everything just because I feel like the oil like brings out like the, the silkiness and like all the foundations and makes them look brighter and more like wet. Like I love a dewy look. I don't like really like matte looks. I like dewy looks and that's what this oil is amazing for. Next. I am obsessed with the Becca um, Shimmering Skin Perfector. I personally use the one in Opal. I think it's more like pinky shades. Like even though I'm very golden undertone, I like using things that are like pink undertone since I have a lot of redness on my skin. And I think that this is like a perfect like shimmer to my skin. It kind of feels like sunscreen. It smells like sunscreen. But it's kind of like a primer, but it's not. It's just meant to like make your skin look luminous, more dewy. So on top of that, I'm putting a primer and then I'm putting oil and then I'm putting this. My skin just stays supple throughout like the entire makeup application. Now, let's dive into foundations. Right now, my Hourglass Vanishing Foundation is amazing. Not only is this the first time that I actually find a shade that matches my skin tone perfectly, but it also, it feels super light on the skin and it's full coverage. So not only is it like super soft and super amazing, but it's also full coverage. So it doesn't feel like you have like all that makeup on your face because nobody wants to feel like that during the day. Especially if you want to do like a 12 hour makeup or whatever, like you cannot feel like you're having like a mask on you. Um, it glides super amazing. Like if you rub it on your skin, you literally, it just glides on. It already looks dewy on the skin like even when you blend it out it just stays dewy the entire time so it's not like a drying formula it's not meant to make you look super matte either but i think the formula is amazing and i personally i don't know what i would do without this i'm so glad that i found this foundation and it's not really an expensive foundation um comparing it to the makeup forever one the makeup forever one i think is 43 this one is 46 but the formula itself feels so much better and it's a lot lighter on the face and on top since it's super full coverage you don't have to apply so much so you don't go through the product as quick as any other stick foundation next a new concealer that i found i've heard a lot about it cosmetics but i've never personally tried a product from them but i recently got this little sample when i went to sephora like on a little shopping haul and it's the Bye Bye Under Eye Illumination. And you, when the girl told me that a little goes a long way, I didn't really believe her because a lot of products say that they do that. But when I tell you that you literally put a dot on your finger and you press it between both and it covers your entire under eye, like all the way, like, but like where you, everybody highlights, I almost died. Like, this tube is so mini and I literally use like a dot and it just covers everything and it, and it feels great on the skin so it's not, you're not going to feel like overbared by the amount that you put on either. Next, eyeshadows. So the first one I'm going to talk about is the Too Faced Power of Makeup um, collaboration with Nikki Tutorials and Too Faced. 
I think that this is like, I mean, personally, this is the first one that I've used that actually comes with like sh eyeshadows. It comes with two blushes, like a pinky one and a peachy one. And it also comes with a highlight and a powder contour. So you, you can literally like open this and like ba bam eyeshadow, ba bam blush, a ba bam contour, a ba bam highlight. Like all in one palette. And I think it's great because first of all, it uses chocolate soleil or soleil or sol sol soleil, soleil, whatever, whatever how you say it. And it smells like chocolate. Like, and it literally like, I've used it and it lasts like a long time, like the smell of the chocolate actually stays a long time. So I'm like, I'll put on this and I'll put on like a vanilla perfume and I'll just smell like a dessert, like dessert dream all day. And I love it. The eyeshadows are really pretty. It comes with like some um, shimmer shades. It comes with like a pinky, silver, gold, and purple one. This blue's from Rock Mall, I love it. And it comes with these nice, super pretty like transition shades that you can use and build. And like the palette itself goes well with each other. <clears throat> and then on top of the two blushes, I think are super pigmented. Like I literally put a dab and I put it on my face and it just like goes everywhere. And I'm like, holy fucking Jesus. But it's always a good thing. And then the highlight, Nikki said that it's, uh, I think, an eyeshadow, but it works great as a highlight. It's like the pinky shade that I love. So it's like a pinky highlight, which I'm obsessed with at the moment. Next. The Godly Massive Palette by Mario. Of course, we're in the fall, so super basic that every girl is buying the palette because there's a lot of fall colors. But in reality, the palette is beautiful. The formula is amazing. I cannot stop talking about it. If you guys see my last video, I actually did a tutorial on it. And the formula is outstanding. Anastasia and Mari did an amazing job. It has a lot of like the darker shades. It actually has a lot of shimmer shades. It has like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It has like nine shimmery shades and like three matte colors. This palette is super hard right now, so I definitely suggest you guys buy it. This palette is outstanding and you guys will not regret it, especially since I think it's only like $45. And for it being such an amazing formula, it really is not expensive at all. <clears throat> for highlights now, I cannot wait. So, of course, Anastasia, I feel like everything I talk about is Anastasia, but Anastasia's line is just phenomenal. Um, the Moon Child, the Moon Child palette. I said channel, Moon Channel, and I have no idea what I was gonna say. But it's another one of her glow kits, and it's beautiful because it has like weird colors. It's not like just like pretty highlights. It comes with, like a purple highlighter, blue. I think this one's yellow or green. Oh shit! It's like mermaid. This is the first time that I actually see that. I never tried this color. It's like mermaidy. It's like this green. And then it has like another like lighter blue and then more blue and then like a super pink one. I've used that super pink one and it's fucking stunning. Like I love it. Especially when you use like super crazy pink all over your eye and you put that pink highlight like holy shit that bitch is wearing a pink highlight. Like bitch watch the fuck out. Like watch the fuck out. I love it of course. We all know the formula of Anastasia's glow kits are beautiful and this does not fail at all. Next, the Jouer highlights. I actually got this as a sample, and this is in the color Seashell. And it's a cream highlighter, which I personally never use. I've always been afraid, because I don't feel like they blend well in the face. But I have been working on learning like how to blend cream highlights. And when I tell you that this highlight is crazy, like, on my finger, and now, like, how the fuck do they make it that shiny? Like, what are you guys putting in it? Like, Jesus dust or something? Like, this is amazing. And on top that it's super creamy, it can blend everywhere all over your face. So I usually put on like, the high points. I put a little bit of eyeliner dab it and blend it with a beauty blender. And then I put on my powder highlight. And <sighs> do you see the outcome? Like, obviously, and it has to be popping, popping. And of course it comes with like this super little cute mirror, which I don't know who can look at anything with this. Like I can barely look at myself in this, like my eye barely fits in here. But whatever, I think it's a great highlighter and I sometimes, I sometimes put this on like my lips, you know. I do like a nude pinky and then I put it on and bam bam, like super highlighted lips. Lips. And I picked like a higher price range, which is like Kylie's lip. Um, this one is her metals and it's her metal matte lipstick and this is in Kai Majesty. I think the formula is beautiful. I love this color. I think it's 
a brand new one in the game. Like I don't, I've never really seen a lipstick company come out with like a black blue with highlighter in it. And of course, her formula smells amazing. I think it's like cocoa butter, chocolate, little bit of cupcake in there, little bit of chocolate muffin. One of those. I have no idea. Like I like smell. It smells amazing, and it does really stay. Like the smell itself on your lips. Like, if you smell your lips, like, it literally stays there, like, all day. Um, this one, I think is $18, this lipstick, if I'm not mistaken. Now, for the low price range, which is still an amazing lipstick, the NYX Liquid Suede Lipstick Line is phenomenal. Like, I personally bought two colors, just so, because they're dupes of Kylie's lipsticks. And I didn't think that they were going to be as good as they are, especially since they're $6. Like, you can literally go to Ulta and for $6 by this lipstick, like, and it's a really big tube, so it's not even like you're getting like jipped on, you know, like on the size. And the formula is crazy pigmented. And I love the little stick. I think the stick is so easy. Like, I've never seen a lipstick with such a small and thin little brush, but for like the edges of your mouth, it's amazing. Like, I can literally like just draw on the edge of my lips and it comes out super fast. But look at the color pigmentation. Like, literally, I pulled it out of the tube. Look at that. One swipe. I literally want to put it on my lips, sleep with it, wake up and be like, where is my parents? Like, why have they been kissing me? Like, I have this bomb ass lipstick and that nigga still ain't kissing me. Hey guys, so that's all the products that I use. These are my go-to favorites right now. Um, I use everything almost on a daily basis. It's a lot of like oils and primers that I use constantly, of course. And all the eyeshadow palettes are very versatile, so it's not only the looks that you can do for the fall, it's for all year round. And I love these palettes, and I love the glow kits and highlighters, which come with like a lot of variety. So it's not like you're buying a product just for that one color, and it's you can like use the product like a lot of times, all the different colors, everything. So I hope you guys like this video. I will um, work on my favorite videos. I need to learn to like get like different types of products. I need to try new products because I feel like I always stay with the same product. Because I feel like once I find something, I love it and I stick with it because it's makeup. You know, you don't want to like ruin your makeup in the middle of like, I don't know, go to an event and you want to try something new and you fuck it up and that's it, like, ouch. Like, that's it, you have to cancel the event. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope you guys tried out these products. Remember to always let me know what products you loved from this and what you're gonna be using from now on because hello, I always give the best suggestions. Anyways guys, I love you so much and I will see you in my next video. Mwah, besos. Personally, personally, um, um, uh, um, uh, a small and thin lake, like small and thin lake. What did I say? <laughs>